So, hi guys, this is a collaboration that I have done with Nat MUA and we have decided to use makeup that's in our Makeup Revolution ASOS box and, and to call, do a collaboration on a look. Now, when you watch this video, you will realise that I decided to try and see if I could use the the glow palette as the bronzer and as the um, blusher however it just resulted in a very very shiny face so um, I used my own bronzer and um, blusher uh, um, so I kind of hope you enjoy this video watching me create this look I kind of really nervous about doing these type of things and mother folk go oh, I absolutely hate it she's not got a clue what she's doing I I'm not trying to tell people how to put their makeup on. This is just a wee bit fun with um Nat and um you know I've been doing my own makeup for a number of, number of years. I can't even speak. Um but I'm not in any way, as you can tell when you watch this, a trained person. Um I d I'm not qualified in <laughs> anything, guys, sorry. Um but I hope you enjoy this and um I certainly had fun doing it. So I'll catch you later. Bye. Hi guys, thanks for joining me. So today I am doing a makeup collaboration with Nat MUA and we are using our makeup from our ASOS Revolution makeup box. So what we kind of agreed is that the rules were that we could use our own foundation and um, concealer and things um, and the rest we would have to use from the ASOS box. So, I've done my eyebrows, um, I've put my concealer and my foundation on. Um, unfortunately, I forgot all about putting on the serum, um, which I think Nat put on before. Yeah, so you put this on your skin, it's a skin conditioning serum, and you put it on your skin morning and night. However, um, I've not done that, so I'm going to pop that in the bathroom. And hopefully remember to do that in the morning. So we have a Revolution liquid highlighter. And it's got the um, the dropper. You see there. It's very scientific -y, doesn't it? Um, we have got the Ultra Pro Glow. So it's got various different shades there. Um, I'm just hoping I can use it. We have the matte lip fix, lip kit even, um, and we have the flawless four. So I will be using my own mascara and eyeliner to complete my look because I am never, um, never finished without my eyeliner. So I'm going to open up this palette. So this is the flawless four palette. Now, Nat is going to recreate my look, so I will be um, showing the colours that I'm using, and that's not because I think I'm, you know, <laughs> it's not because it's a tutorial or anything, but it's just so that Nat knows which colours I'm using. So my Bittersweet, unfortunately, um, can you see that there? My Bittersweet got a little bit kind of, arrived a little bit, cracked up but that's fine um this palette's also got a big mirror so i will be using that mirror and hopefully um i can kind of try and create a look that's not too um similar to my everyday look but that it's a wee bit different um and then i will be recreating nat's look i'm not sure when i'll be doing that i will probably be doing that on friday um when i've got some more natural light or um I might try today later on wipe all this off if I can be bothered um, and try again so as always when you decide you're going to film one of these videos and it's an up close and kind of personal encounter I have another blooming spot so it's the same one from um, the weekend Mount Vesuvius has erupted so this shade has got some shimmers it's got some mattes it's got some highlighters and um, so it, it has a, a good range so i have put some powder on my face already and i have um, put concealer on my eyelids so i've not set my eyelids so i'm going to use one of the shades that are on here to set my eyelids 
and I'm filming today on my, my hair's still not dry, but it's much better than it usually is, guys. Um, I am filming today using my new iPhone X, so I am really hoping that you can hear me much better today, guys. And I've got my Makeup Revolution brush and my Luxie brush. Um, so I will be using those. I'm not going to be giving you the technical terms and names for the brushes because... I don't know what they are, so there's big fluffy one, flat one, and little kind of angle pointy one. So <laughs> that will be about it for me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the um, this fluffy brush here. I am going to use that to go in with a colour to set my eyelid. And I think I will be setting my eyelid with the colour Sunday. So that's third... Well, um, Third row, first. Oh, quite a lot of um, colour comes off of there. So I will be setting my eyelid in that colour. How have you guys been getting on? Um, oh, I'm having one of these days. I'm trying to get so much done. Um, and it's just not happening. So there we go, I kind of set my lid with the colour Sunday. There you go, it's quite nice isn't it? So what am I going to do? So I want to go in with a transition shade and a transition shade should ideally be quite a light shade. Um, however, I don't know what look I am going to go for. So I think think there's a lot of shimmers in this palette so I think I am going to go in with the shade pastel as my transition shade so I am going to go in with pastel and then so that's the very bottom and it's the second one in this is helpful for that or if you've got the flawless four um, don't follow me because I don't have a clue what I'm doing. So some of these shades um, are really pigmented. Other ones aren't so much. Um, however, that doesn't really bother me. I don't mind actually building a shade up. Um... And for once, the sunlight is actually working in my favour. And I can film at my usual angle. <laughs> I've just noticed. <laughs> I bought a new bra from Marquis the other day there. And it's slightly <laughs> too small. So I just shoved it over that coat hanger. And I've just looked over my shoulder. And I can see it, so it is clean, it's new, so <laughs> apologies. I suppose it could be worse, couldn't it? I don't know if any of you have watched, um, I, I subscribed to a lady called Anwin, and um, I'm going to actually go in, you can't really see the pastel, so I'm going to actually go in with some ouch. Uh, yeah, I follow a lady called Anwin, and um, she's always got something over her radiators, and the other week there it was a or a handle it was handcuffs but she's got wee boys so she was saying it was theirs but she's quite funny she does quite a lot of aliexpress hauls um i've never ordered anything from aliexpress however the stuff that she's ordered um aliexpress can take weeks um so i'm just slightly going into my crease here um with this ouch um, so yeah, AliExpress can take weeks. So I'm just going to build that up. Um, yeah, it can take weeks to arrive. But most of it is available on the, on Amazon. So there's a few palettes I kind of fancy trying. But 
I need to try some of the palettes that I've already got first. So I have decided to put myself on a no makeup by March. Um, unless it's something I run out of or I can't live without it. So there you go. Um, and I don't know what that would actually be because um, I've got everything. I don't think I need any skincare. Um, I'm actually, do you know what? I've got a new set of brushes, but I cannot be bothered going to get them. So I'm just going to go in and do my V now with, um, what colour am I going to do my V with? I'm going to go in with Rock Me, which is this shade here, Rock Me. Um, I'm going to go in with that. Yeah, so... I've decided there's quite a few people that are doing it no buy low buy <sighs> some people are doing it for the year um wacky world of lottie she's doing it um i'm trying to think who else is doing it there's a couple of people I that i know that are doing it but i can only think of lottie at the moment so i'm using quite a big brush um to go in and do my B to smoke out the kind of corner. I did buy these little guards for them to try from Trimark, but I haven't tried them yet. Um, I've never used tape or anything. I've just kind of faffed about and done it myself. So I'm just concentrating on my corner with this one and going in a bit into my crease. A bit and smoking that out, blending that out a wee bit. I know it's not a blending brush I'm using, but there we go. So I am going to go for something quite spectacular. I think I'm going to go for something really shimmery. I am going to go for Cardinal, which is this shade here. Can you see it there? I'm going to go in with Cardinal. So that's nice and light and it'll brighten it up. Um, you could do a cut crease, I suppose, as well. But I'm just going to go in with Cardinal. Oh, that's lovely. Can you see that? It's really nice. I like that. It's not a kind of, well, I don't know. It's kind of just a bit different to my everyday makeup. Just a little bit more glam. So what am I going to put under my bottom lash, my lower lash? I'm going in with this. This is also make a very good eyebrow brush. Um, but it also does your under under eye um, I don't want to do something too dark so I am going to go in with this colour that we are calling burn it oh, this one here and this is called burn it here there's quite a lot of um, colour payoff coming off the brush but there's not any Fall out on my face. So that's good. Quite pleased with that. Um, back in the day, I would do this with my eyeliner. I wouldn't do it with my eyeshadow. Um, I used to do my waterline with my coal. Um, I've not done that for a long, long time. I'm going to take that up actually, up into my, where my wing is going to be. I'm going to take that up there and I'm going to kind of put that in. So do a little kind of V there. And then 
I'm just going to blend that out slightly. Blending it out. Using the wrong brush as well. I'm not using my blending brush, I'm using my flat brush. Um, does anybody really care? I mean, up until recently, um, I did my eyeshadow with one brush. I'm not going to lie to you. I am not going to lie to you. I'm going to take some of the bloom and highlight my um, highlight here. Bloom. Mm, yeah. So I'm just buffing that in. There's some really lovely colours in here. There's a lot of reds and browns and pinks and things. Um, you bear with me. I'm just going to... My nose is running. I hope you didn't see that on camera, just rubbing my nose. Um, yeah. So, the hair is almost dry, isn't it? I feel like funny today. I feel like, I don't know what's going on with my makeup, to be honest with you. Um, so I'm going to open this Ultra Pro Glow and put some this highlight on. Um, now, I don't think there's a... Mm, is that too shiny for a coat? I'm going to try and use that brown one. So the bottom one... Um, I'm going to try and use that as a bronzer. I never put any bronzer on. So I'm going to try and use this one as bronzer. Um, I will let you know. Well, you can see, can't you? You can work with me and see what you think. So I use this um, fluffy brush. Mm, yeah, that's quite nice, isn't it? I thought it might be shiny, but it's not too bad. Mm -hmm. It's looking good. It's looking good. My husband's going to come home from work and be like, what have you been up to? Where are you going? Why have you got all this makeup on? Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Yeah, you need to blend, blend, blend that out. Sorry, you know what? Sit and watch me. <laughs> sit and watch the mirror. Um, so yeah, I actually thought this was quite a good um, wee challenge to do. Um, because it also meant that I was using my palette. Um, which I haven't done. I, I, I haven't used any of the makeup. Um, now I'm going to go in um, with this one and use this as my blusher so wish me luck it's quite the palette's got a good mirror on it and the flawless four and they don't always so it's it's pretty good however the pro glow doesn't so i'm sitting i'm sitting working like this and i'm going to mix the top highlighter and the pink I mean, to be honest, I do not think that this Pro Glow is designed to be used as a blusher. So I am going to have to use my own blusher because I've just ended up with a very pink. <laughs> it's a beautiful highlight. Um, 
yeah i've just ended up with a really beautiful uh <laughs> pink highlighted face so i am going to go over that with my own um blusher um yeah can you see how shiny my face was so so yeah i would probably stick to using this as a highlighter um now as a highlighter um it covers kind of i think a lot of skin tones um but just perhaps not as blonder blah, 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 blondes i can't even speak bronzer or a blusher so i'm going to use my own bronzer and my own blush or i'm gonna to have to wash my face before i go anywhere i am shiny pink um yeah <laughs> and to be honest i sure not started her video with our bronzer on um so however I mean, my face is glowing, like, you know, it's really glowing. It's maybe glowing a bit too much. Um, Nat, you can um, just ignore what I've done and not put the... <laughs> not put the highlighter on as blusher and bronzer. Um, you can use your own. So I'm actually quite excited though to try it as a highlighter, right? So what colour am I going to go for? Um, I think I'm going to go for this one here. And mix it with this one. So this one and this one. Um, and I'm going to go in with my Luxie highlighter. I love this brush by the way. Um, so yeah, I'm going to mix two of those shades um, together. <sighs> Mm. I mean, I am just positively glowing today. Mm -hmm. Yep, I am glowing. And I'm going to go in and use um, this shade here for my Cupid's bow. Yeah, glowing. Glowing, glowing, glowing. Beautiful. <laughs> wow. I um, saw Stephanie Toms do that. And this highlighter is probably far too dark. Um, however, hey ho, it's a play, isn't it? It's good fun. Um, I've enjoyed it anyway. So we get one colour here. So apparently it's new and improved matte lip kit. Oh, and you get the pencil as well. Oh, look at this colour. It's beautiful. Um, and it's called Rain. And I've actually got this colour somewhere. Um, so if you bear with me, I am going to dig that colour out so that I'm not... Um, opening that and I can pop that in a giveaway. Um, it was in Sophie's Choice. I'm digging around here, guys. You have to forgive me. I've got Noble. I've got Rain. Yeah. I, um, I swatched the one in Sophie's Choice. Bloody hell. Um, what I'm going to try and do, if you will forgive me, oh, I can't do it, I've my, I dropped my makeup bag this morning, um, and a few things rolled out, and the one thing that rolled out was my powder, and it just smashed into smithereens, so it's downstairs, so what I'm just going to do is I'm just going to try and rub away some of the shininess. Right, because I think I've just gone a bit OTT with it. So, this rain and 
this um, Ultra Pro Glow palette have not been touched. So I'm going to pop them in a giveaway because I, I, I will never use um, two, pal two highlighter palettes. And I'd rather give somebody the opportunity to win that in a giveaway. Um, okay, so I've just taken the wrapper off the lip liner. It's quite a nice feel to this lip liner. It goes on nicely, is what I want to say. Okay, and I'm going to pop some rain on and then I'm going to do my um, eyeliner. Quite a nice colour, isn't it? I'm not getting a lot out though. Okay. Quite nice, I like that. And so now, oh, I didn't even touch on the liquid highlighter okay do you want me to <laughs> i'm going to just pop a couple of wee drops up here right because <laughs> i'm shining already shining brighter than a diamond aren't i in the words of rihanna i am shining like a diamond very bright um there we go So bright. Right. Where are we? Where are we, people? planning on using a coal today however this is in my panning project so I may as well use it up um, sorry guys you can't see what I'm doing I've actually become used to the sharpness of the um, liquid liner but this will do for today that'll do um I think sometimes with your, um, what's the word I was going to say? Um, when you when you do the V, you can sometimes get away without the eyeliner, um, if you want.
Okay. It's quite a matte lipstick, so what I would probably do is go over the matte lipstick with um, the jelly shot that I have. And um, so this is my finished look, guys, and I hope you like it. Bar the kind of shininess, um, I'm quite pleased with it. Um, it's not a million miles away from what I would do for a night out, um, but yeah, I'm quite pleased with it. So. If you want to go and see what Nat's done, she's Nat N U M U A. So I'm going to link um, to her page so you can go and see what she's done. And um, I am going to copy her look. So wish me well. Speak to you later. Bye, guys.